One transfer that Manchester United could complete on deadline day is Daily Blind to AS Roma. What I'm going to do is run through the full story of the transfer for you. Let's get into it. Now, reports emerged from Italy the day before transfer deadline day that Daily Blind had said yes to a move to AS Roma, who were looking for a replacement after selling Palmieri to Chelsea. Now, on transfer deadline day, Gazzetta della Sport and Il Tempo are both reporting that a deal is going to be very hard to push through simply because of time constraints. It's transfer deadline day. We haven't really heard anything about Blind leaving Man United. And all of a sudden, it's come with only 24 hours to go in the transfer window. Is there enough time to complete it? The suggestions from Italy is that is not the case. But Sky Sports reporting that AS Roma are in negotiations with Manchester United over a deal for Daily Blind. But then Daddy Blind's dad, Danny Blind, he piped up and had this to say about the transfer. He said, I can confirm that AS Roma wants Daly, but Man United don't want to let him go on loan, only on a permanent basis. They don't want to sell him now, only in the summer. Maybe if we had a few days, a week perhaps, but we've only got a few hours. So Daly Blind's dad confirming that Man United are willing to let Daly Blind go, but only on a permanent deal. That's what the suggestion is. And then Gianluca Di Marzio popped up. We all know he is a very reliable source as far as United transfer news goes, especially when it's linked with Italian teams. He is saying that no agreement has been reached between Roma and Man United over Blind, and that because of that, Roma have turned their attention towards sporting Lisbon left-back Jonathan Silva. So all in all, at the moment, no deal has been agreed, but Daley Blind wants to move to Roma because he's not going to get that much first-team football at Man United anymore. Man United are willing to let him go, but only on a permanent deal rather than a loan deal that Axel Twanzebe to Aston Villa and Roma want Blind. But will a deal be done? Is it right for Man United to let Daley Blind go? I mean, if you look at the pecking order right now, you probably put Eric Bailly, Phil Jones, Chris Smalling, Marcus Rojo, all ahead of Daley Blind in the pecking order of centre-backs. You put Luke Shaw and Ashley Young both ahead of Daley Blind at left-back. You put Nemanja Matic, probably Michael Carrick as well, ahead of Daley Blind at central defensive midfield. It's clear to see that Daley Blind is not going to be getting much game time anymore at United. You know, he was a superb central defensive midfielder when we signed him from Ajax. He was a fantastic utility player playing centre-back and left-back. But he was never really a first-team reg... He was a first-team regular, but he was never one of the first names on your team sheet. I don't think, anyway. Maybe not being a little bit unfair on Daley Blind. I still think he's a fantastic footballer, but what is clear, a bit like Mkhitaryan, I still think he's a fantastic footballer, but he's not going to get game time at Man United under Jose Mourinho. And for him, the best move for his career is to leave Man United. It's clear United are happy for that to happen, but only on the terms that we want. It sounds like we don't want to loan him like Twan Zebe, we want to let him go on a permanent deal. His contract runs out next summer, so it's probably the best way for us to get more money out of Roma if we do want to sell him. But let me know what you think. Do you think it's right to let Daley Blind go on transfer deadline day? Or do you want to keep him in the squad until the summer and then let him go? Let me know in the comments as always. If there's any more updates, I'll bring them to you. Please drop a like on this video if you liked it. We'll see you soon. Take it easy.